Hey everybody, Ashton Dreamer here, as always, with Fantastic OKC. Say hello, Fantastic. Hello, Fantastic. Your your horse pushed me, by the way. I'm not even looking at the camera, am I? Nope. Okay. And the baby's up. Whenever we're doing this, I kind of need you to angle the camera to where I'm looking. Okay, I'm sorry. I mean, unless I'm like... Because she knows we're trying to record. See? I mean, she has an excuse. She's a baby. Uh, him, he should be in bed asleep. Right here. <laughs> Am I right looking at there. it now? Yes, you are. I don't like talking if I don't have a camera. Right here. Please say hello, fantastic. Hello, fantastic. <laughs> oh, goodness. What? You made me lose my train of thought because sorry. I was thinking about how you always do that. I'm sorry. Hey everybody, Ashton Dreamer here with Fantastic OKC. Say hello, Fantastic. Hello, Fantastic. And we are here doing another show and tell. We are back at the stables today, and I'm really not sure what you guys saw last time, but I know that there were not horses here. Nope. I had a colt to show you. This is it. Not a colt anymore. Nope. It's a horse now. Hello. Full grown horse. Um, but this is where I've been breeding the horses at. We've got some variations here, and I don't really have too much to say about this other than I've just been breeding horses, and I plan on having like an entire horse ranch. You guys have already seen the inside of the stables. I don't think that there's anybody in there right now except for the guys that we rode over here on. So let's just go ahead and come this way. If you want to grab that horse right there that has the saddle, I will let you show our lovely viewers this. The equestrian course. Yes. Yay. I made this entire course. I should have grabbed a horse too because there is also the racetrack. Uh, I can't get over this one. There, there we go. go. I got pretty good at this not too long ago. There are various difficulty levels and various things that you go through. I did it all based on memory from watching horse shows and um, uh, rodeos. <laughs> so some of the things are based off of real things and then some of them are probably just things that I just kind of came up with. Hopefully it's fun, they... non it's fun nonetheless. I like it. Thank we should know. race. Okay, let me go grab a horse. Do you want to race on the obstacles or on the track? I don't know how we would do it. I was going to say, if we had a, t a stopwatch or a timer or something, because the thing about the obstacles is it would be really cool to do the whole course and time it and see how long it takes the other person to go through the course, rather than doing one side versus the other, because the sides are different, the, the obstacles are different. So I guess we would want to just go around... The racetrack. Okay, so we're going to start here at the gate. Sure. Okay, do you want to count it down or do you want me to? Uh, I don't care. Okay, I'll count it down. Three, two, one. Oh. Oh my <laughs> god, your horse is fast. Is, is he? That's cool. I don't know. I just, there's, it's a random horse you gave me. It's oh not my Sir, goodness. it's not Sir Edwin L. McRuffle Duffy. That might be who I'm on. This horse is slow. Are you on, Edwin? I Wow, I win. I win a lot. Who am I on? This is your horse. If that's Edwin? Yeah. Hey, what well, horse he, are you on? He's a hardy horse. Doesn't have I a name. Know. I don't know. What do... Okay, whatever. Okay, anyways, that is the track and the obstacle course. And just real quick, let's go ahead and sh also show them where we're going to be doing the sheep breeding. Sheep breeding! This area, and if you have... I have stone bricks, but if you have something that you can like build up with, you'll be able to get a better view so that you can see what's actually going on over there. I have one piece of cobblestone. Here. I don't need to see because I've seen. Okay. So take those. But if you go up and look, it is a big grid. It is, let's see, four by four. 
That's what it looks like from here. I can't really tell. Uh, yes, 4x4 four four grid. And that is enough to hold every color of sheep available. Which, as you can see, we don't have colored sheep yet because I'm wanting to do an episode where we run off and go find the flowers and it's like a big race. So for now, I've got the natural colors. We've got the white, black, brown, gray, and dark gray. Later on, we'll have all the other colors back there in the back. We will be breeding them and shearing them over here. And that's how we're going to get our colored wool for all of the builds or whatever else we want colored wool for. Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay. Excellent. All right. I think that's about it, right? Yes, it is. Okay. So if you uh, enjoyed this episode, click the like button. Don't forget to subscribe and comment on our stuff and check us out on Facebook. Um, okay. Bye, everybody. Have a wonderful time. Bye.